Good morning. Uh, well, this is my grandma, and this picture was taken in 1949, and she was uh, she was 17 at the time. So her lifelong dream was to well, she was an immigrant, so she came over here and she wanted a she was a registered <coughs> nurse, but like uh, she was in an accident, which like basically her I think it was her pinky was like cut off, so she kind of like. I had to stop being a nurse. So, uh, I don't know about you guys, but I've always had the intention of like being someone. And uh, my major is being a registered nurse as well, because this lovely woman uh, inspired me. She's always used the right words. Like, um, <coughs> she, always, she told me that I should be a leader, not a follower. And uh, it, I, I've taken pride in those words because I come from a, like a family of like, well, she's had 13 grandchildren. So I am the, I am the four to uh, graduate high school and uh, third to come to college. So she's, she's always been helpful and my mom always tells me stories about how she's, uh, she's always been there for someone. She's always put others in front of her. Bef like she's always been like the leader. She's always uh, been the type of person that puts others before herself. So I like that. That's well, that's what I like to do. I like to, I guess, I won't be like, I am your leader. I won't be like that. <laughs> but I will be like, if you need help, I will be there for you if, well, you have nobody to go to. So, uh, uh, well, Basically, in conclusion, I just just love to live up to my expectations and accomplish what she never really got to accomplish because she only worked as a nurse for about two years, and I want to go further than that. And if she lived, well, she's still alive, so I would love to like tell her stories about how I went further in like nursing and maybe soon to be a doctor. So. Thank you. <laughs>